In the heart of Staunton, Virginia, a decisive victory for journalistic integrity and the essence of open governance unfolded as our company breaking through media alongside our editor Samuel Joseph Orlando secured a landmark legal triumph against the Augusta County Board of Supervisors. This battle, a critical test of the Virginia Freedom of Information Act's effectiveness, reached a climactic conclusion with a judicial verdict that didn't just challenge but rebuked Augusta County's dismissive approach to the law, emphasizing a dire need for unwavering commitment to transparency. Judge Thomas J. Wilson, IFOR's ruling transcended the realms of procedural win, standing as a testament to breaking through media's relentless quest for accountability. Amina Matheny Willard, the attorney behind this legal odyssey, adeptly narrated in court the county's casual attitude towards legislation meant to ensure its operations remained in the public eye. In a decisive move, Judge Wilson embraced Matheny Willard's piercing critique of the county's nonchalant stance towards legal obligations. Matheny Willard's words resounded as a stark call to action. Augusta County and its advocates have showcased an alarming indifference to the law, its clear language and the mandates it enforces. This was not merely a legal discourse, it was a profound statement on the duty of governance and the essence of democracy, and Augusta County's failure to live up to that duty. With poignant clarity, Matheny Willard illuminated the absurdity of a governing entity using public funds to cloak its actions from the very citizens who provide those funds. Her compelling argument was more than legal rhetoric. It was a stark reminder of the fundamental principles of democracy, transparency and accountability. The court's decision to adopt Matheny Willard's standpoint marks a pivotal moment in the crusade for transparent governance. Matheny Willard's profound assertion that if only the county had acknowledged and rectified its errors, the court and the public wouldn't have to confront such blatant disregard for the law underscores a missed opportunity for integrity and transparency. Echoing a recent scandal from a member of the Augusta County Board who spoke about his fondness for a time when there was corporal punishment in schools, Matheny Willard poetically summed up the judgment. Those who disobey the law should be dealt with as children and should be grateful when they are taught a lesson. The court should teach the county's board of supervisors their lesson today and they should be grateful for that education and take it to heart. As the dust of this legal showdown settles, breaking through media's victory emerges not just as a win in court, but as a beacon of hope and a stark reminder of the power of persistent journalism and the rule of law. This judgment is not just a statement to Augusta County, but a message to all governing bodies. The law, when pursued with determination and integrity, is an unyielding guard against the encroaching shadows of secrecy. For the citizens of Augusta County and beyond, this victory is a reassurance that true journalism, coupled with a steadfast legal system, remains a formidable force in the quest for transparency and accountability. To stay up to date on the latest legal news, subscribe to Breaking Through News on the Newsbreak app or on our website at breakingthrough.com.